An exciting new tool in the CART Select Series 4 is Linear Feature Extraction, which allows you to create accurate models of linear objects such as tunnels and bridge components. Let's take a look at how a 3D loft surface can be extracted from this linear bridge deck. In preparation for this example, a line string representing the profile of the bridge has already been created. This was done by creating a section through the bridge and then trace digitizing the resulting point cloud section. A template is a graphical object that is used to derive surfaces and edges from a point cloud. Templates are created from existing graphics such as line strings, complex chains, and shapes. Tools on the Template tab allow you to define constraints which associates vertices to a master vertex. Constraints are useful when modeling a feature that is constant on one side and variable on another. For example, a road crown and crossfall which is constant and a ditch which is variable. The Model by Section tool makes a project which is used to create a 3D model from a template. Model by Section requires a defined template from the Template tab and a defined section from the Section tab. The Append Template Copy tool places a copy of the template in the Section view. It can then be moved into position and, if needed, the vertices can be adjusted to fit the Point Cloud section. When the template matches the point cloud section, a reset will automatically move the section forward and another template will be placed. You can continue adding templates in this manner until the length of the linear feature is defined. When enough templates have been defined, the Generate settings can be adjusted for creating the final output. Here, the Loft Surface and Connecting Lines options are defined for the 3D surface. Clicking the Generate button will create the surface geometry as defined by the templates. And the resulting surface is examined by changing the view presentation style. And when the point cloud is turned on, you can see just how well the extracted 3D surface fits. Let's now watch how the Linear Feature Extraction tool is used to model a portion of this railway tunnel. A template is created from the existing profile element. A new model by section is created by selecting the existing template and section. A project is created and template copies are placed and adjusted to fit the point cloud section. Notice how the section automatically moves forward in the top view for each template copy and that a preview of the loft surface is generated in the slave view.
Finally, the completed surface is rendered in illustration mode.